Giddy up, people. We're off the races in just two days. It's the 143rd running of the roses, the Kentucky Derby, known as the greatest <laughs> two minutes in sports. <laughs> so call up your friends and invite them over because we're going to show you how to throw the derby party to end all derby parties. And here with some ideas for everything from food to drinks and decor is lifestyle and entertaining expert JJ Karras. Hey, Hi, JJ. Hi, JJ. Good to see you. Thanks for having me. We're glad you're, you're here. Thank we you. Look like, say? We look like the two royal stepdaughters. Remember that? Yeah. 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 No, it's so <laughs> yes. appropriate for the derby, right? So out of the gate, okay, yes. any key to successful derby party, you just have to have a mint julep. Primary ingredients right. are bourbon, yeah. simple syrup, uh -huh. mint, and crushed ice. Love, okay? your, pre love your presentation, by the way. So That's you just want a nice bar. Sometimes a mint yep. julep bar is really nice. We also did some ginger beer and sweet tea. Sweet yes, uh -huh. please take one. Help okay. yourselves. All right. So we're just going to, I'm going to demo one for you okay, really good. fast, okay? So the first thing we're going to do is simple syrup, which is really just sugar and water. Sugar water, right? It's just yeah. sugar water. Okay. And you put it at the bottom. Mm -hmm. And then That's mint. About how many mint, calories mint, mint. Say. Lots of mint. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> not, not counting not berries on Derby right, Day, and baby. And then you spank the mint, okay? It releases oh. the oil. And you know what you say? Oh, Talk little... derby to me. Talk derby, derby to me. me. Okay, so come say, on. Lord, so wait. much Give innuendo. It <laughs> and then you muddle it, but you don't bruise it. You just muddle it, okay? okay. Muddle don't the mint. Don't leave a bruise. Don't leave a bruise. Muddle da -da 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 -da. the mint. And then the um, crushed ice uh -huh. over it and lots and lots of ice. Okay. okay, don't go shy on the ice. And then you pour the bourbon over that. More bourbon? More bourbon. No, that, be, so that was simple oh, syrup. Oh, that was okay. simple syrup. All right, bourbon. Top it off with mint. Lots okay. Of, it's healthy because right. there's mint. Okay. And I like a sh little straw so you can get down Perfect. there. Get in and there. Really get in smell there. Smell the mint. Soda? It's right here. I finished it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> There's another version of these, yes, of okay, the mint I'm julep. Sure I had to bring it. Look, this is a mint julep jelly. If you didn't no. want to do this, it's a bourbon jello shot. Okay, yeah. ladies, it's okay. a bourbon oh, jello shot. You're kidding. No, it's, you want to try one? No. <laughs> no. These were, these were not in high school at a yeah. frat party. <laughs> Look what I can. Okay. And then, of course, uh, we have maybe our adorable. Maybe after the show. And okay. I'm just kidding. And well. then we have our adorable horse plates. Um, and these are from World Market. So Those appropriate for the day. Cute, cute. Okay, I'm going to take you Foods. back to 1926. Yes. The Earth to born. Louisville. <laughs> To Louisville. Oh. This is a classic <laughs> traditional. Sorry. <laughs> this is a classic traditional hot brown sandwich. It's turkey, tomato. Oh, you good. cross the bacon. Famous in Louisville started from the Brown Hotel in 1926. I'm sorry, Hody. <laughs> right so, after yeah. a few juleps, if you get okay. my drift, okay, ladies. Right. Okay. All right. And then of course our, our tea Let's sandwiches, our finger sandwiches, simply wrapped with um, a cucumber. Mm -hmm. For a contrast, I did pumpernickel and white bread. And then the Kentucky bourbon meat. Mm, these are good. Thank those are you. Great. Aren't those delicious? Mm -hmm. So you can just throw a little bourbon in your sauce with your ketchup JJ, and brown show us sugar. Some, some desserts. This is okay. beautiful, by the so way. So the Kentucky Derby these is the run mm. of the roses. Right. Red Freedom Roses are the official flower of the roses and a must at any derby is that party. Because they grow there in Kentucky so beautifully. I don't know that, but it's been a tradition for mm -hmm. wow, um, almost 60 years. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> it's been a tradition for almost 60 years. The Red Freedom Rose. Red Freedom. Okay. So, anyways, you just take this. These are great. So heavenly. And we're going to go around. Look how easy this is. You could do a vanilla, a chocolate cupcake, and you just Pretty. go you around. You could actually store by these cupcakes and just decorate them yeah, up. Yeah, abs okay. absolutely. All right. Mm -hmm. Good. Love okay. that. Okay. And then. Have another one. Okay. Meatball. Yeah, go ahead, have another. And then we have to have derby pie for dessert. Okay. Warm, chocolatey, and rich in your mailbox. What's in derby pie? Who doesn't pie? love that? Well, it's actually a secret recipe and only known by the Kearns Family Kitchen in Louisville. Oh. So you can just order it. And if you ordered this today, and it'll be there in time. It'll be there in time. All it right. serves eight to ten. We don't have time for the last table, but we would okay. like to show you that it's there are some fun games you can play along yes, the fun way. Games. Too. We have website. Everything yeah. will be on the website. And bonnet toss. Yep. Happy yeah. derby oh, day. Happy derby. Thanks, JJ. Ladies. Thanks, Wendy. Thank Thank you. Talk Derby to us, everybody. Oh, Coverage yeah. of the Kentucky Derby starts Saturday at noon on NBC at what? And at 2.30 right here on NBC. What? Nobody knows. Why? Hello today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.